Hey YouTubers, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you what the symptoms are of a hydrolocked lawnmower. First of all, let me explain what I mean by hydrolocked. What that means is that too much oil has gotten between the head here inside the cylinder and the piston. Now there's so much oil inside the cylinder between the piston and the head here that there's no room for the motor to turn at all. The piston cannot even go up the cylinder because the oil is stopping it from going up. One of the symptoms is that you're going to see a lot of oil coming out of the muffler and there it is right there. And the other symptom is that you won't be able to crank it over. In this case here it does turn a bit but barely and it's really hard to turn over. Usually what will cause this problem is when people start the lawnmower upright like this with oil in the engine. So what you should do if this happens to you is remove the spark plug. Move the cap out of the way. Now what you need to do is to pull over the mower and all the oil is going to come out of the spark plug hole. And as you can see there, there's more oil coming out of the muffler. That's a good sign. That means it's draining itself. And I'll just repeat that process until you think you've removed all the oil from the engine. So now that I think all the oil's out, I'm going to use some quick start, spray it in the spark plug hole, and try to fire it up. And point the quick start toward the left here because that's where the cylinder is. Now when you start it, it's going to smoke like crazy, but that's normal because it's just burning the excess oil that's left over in the cylinder. Actually, at this point, I'm going to spray the quick start inside the carburetor. Man, look at all that smoke. That's crazy. That's all the oil burning up. So I've ran it for approximately 15 minutes and now the exhaust is clear. So I'll get it a start just to show you that the exhaust is cleared up. Hopefully this video has helped you how to repair this problem. Oftentimes you're going to find mowers at the end of people's driveways, at the dump, in yard sales, and people think that the motors are blown in them. But actually, it's just the problem that I showed you in this video today. So keep your eye out for mowers that people are throwing out, and thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.